it's your boy double one three four down back in our video today's video. Um so an article um slash where I actually looked on someone else's video, Mr. Matty plays, um would you guys go check him out? He's a lot of good information. Um that Fallout four was a poor non violent plane, which means maybe you don't have to kill someone or others to complete that mission or to complete that objective. And I was really thinking about that and I was like, oh wow, that's cool, you can go minimum killing. And I'm just like, this is gonna mean, and then like in my head after about like 10 minutes, like a couple minutes of thinking about this, I was like, support, so maybe like two factions are fighting and you want to end the violence. You want to end it. And you sit them both down to talk, have a meeting, to compromise somehow. And have a good conversation with them and say, yo, bro, I'll, I'm chill with you. I, I understand you want to. I understand that you want to kill that guy. But in the end, that guy will probably end up killing more of your people. And he'll probably end up having a lot of deaths too. It won't be good for either your economies or whatever, blah, 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 blah. And maybe you can have, you can end conflicts more civilian-like. Maybe you can take more charge. Maybe if there's like a feud between you, maybe there's like a feud between two of your people instead of like, you know, maybe like settling it by killing one of them or killing both or exiling both of them. You can figure out the problem and do what you need to do and have fun with them and like be like, yo, this is good, this is okay, you. Uh, so that's what I believe. Uh, I believe it actually means a lot more than it actually is. Maybe it doesn't, but I hope it does. I hope you can end conflicts uh, in the non-violent playthrough. So see you guys. Peace out. See you guys later. Bye.